Heavenly Father, we humbly gather before you to explore Luke chapter 11, verses 47 to 54, where Jesus confronts the hypocrisy of religious leaders. Open our hearts to your teachings and inspire us to seek true righteousness and authenticity. In your holy name, we pray, amen. Let us read, woe to you, because you build tombs for the prophets, and it was your ancestors who killed them. So you testify that you approve of what your ancestors did. They killed the prophets, and you build their tombs. Because of this, God in his wisdom said, I will send them prophets and apostles, some of whom they will kill, and others they will persecute. Therefore, this generation will be held responsible for the blood of all the prophets that has been shed since the beginning of the world, from the blood of Abel to the blood of Zechariah, who was killed between the altar and the sanctuary. Yes, I tell you, this generation will be held responsible for it all. Woe to you experts in the law, because you have taken away the key to knowledge. You yourselves have not entered, and you have hindered those who were entering. When Jesus went outside, the Pharisees and the teachers of the law began to oppose him fiercely and to besiege him with questions, waiting to catch him in something he might say. Gracious God, as we meditate on these verses, we are reminded of Jesus' stern rebuke of hypocrisy and the need for genuine righteousness. Lord, we confess that at times, we may be more concerned with appearances than authentic faith. We acknowledge moments when we may hinder others from seeking your truth dot 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 in a world filled with distractions and false pretenses. We find inspiration in Jesus' call for true righteousness. We are challenged to live with integrity and humility. Heavenly Father, we come before you, seeking hearts of authenticity and true righteousness, just as Jesus emphasized in Luke chapter 11, verses 47 to 54. We lift up to you any moments of hypocrisy and insincerity in our lives. We pray for the wisdom to recognize the importance of genuine faith and the danger of hypocrisy. May we be authentic in our relationship with you and others. We ask for the grace to refrain from hindering those who seek your knowledge and truth. May we be encouragers and guides to those on their spiritual journey. We lift up to you those who may struggle with hypocrisy in their faith. May they find the strength to seek true righteousness and authenticity. We pray for the humility to admit our faults and to live with integrity, recognizing that your truth is found in authenticity and genuine faith dot 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 in all things. May our hearts be aligned with Christ's call for true righteousness and authenticity seeking to know you more deeply and to live with genuine faith. We offer this prayer in the name of Jesus, who calls us to true authenticity. Amen.